Hello friends, in this video we make 5,5 diphenyl hydrogen toin, also called phenytoin by the base catalyzed reaction between benzyl and urea. Phenytoin has been long used as an anti-seizure medication. Materials required for this preparation include 5.3 grams of benzyl, 3 grams of urea, 15 milliliters of 30% sodium hydroxide solution, 30 milliliters of ethanol and hydrochloric acid to make the solution acidic. A 100 milliliter round bottom flask with a steering bar was attached on a clamp, then 5.3 grams of pure benzyl was introduced into it. Benzyl was synthesized in one of my previous videos, do check that out. Now, 3 grams of urea was weighed out and added on top of benzyl. Next, 15 milliliters of 30% aqueous sodium hydroxide solution was added to the flask, followed by 30 milliliters of 96% ethyl alcohol was added to the flask. Now, a reflex condenser was attached on top and the mixture was reflexed by gently boiling the mixture for 2 hours. Let us see what is happening now. This is the overall reaction that is taking place. It is a base catalyzed reaction between benzyl and urea. The reaction is proceeding via a intramolecular cyclization to form an intermediate heterocyclic pinacol, which is soluble in water. Later on acidification yield phenytoin as a result of 1,2 diphenyl shift in the pinacol rearrangement reaction. After 2 hours, the reflex was stopped and the mixture was allowed to cool to room temperature. Then the contents of the reaction mixture was poured into 100 ml of distilled water and was mixed carefully. Allow the reaction mixture to stand for 15 minutes. By that time, insoluble products must have formed. So we do a filtration and we will remove these insoluble products. I am doing a simple gravity filtration method. The filtrate was collected in an Erlenmeyer flask. A separatory funnel was attached on top of it which was filled with 37% hydrochloric acid. Hydrochloric acid was added dropwise into the flask with stirring. After some time, you can see a precipitate forming and this is the crude phenytoin. The crude phenytoin that was formed was filtered by a simple gravity filtration method. Finally, after drying, this is the crude product phenytoin that we obtained. It was then allowed to recrystallize from ethanol. The needle shaped crystals of pure phenytoin was then stored in an airtight bottle. So that's all in this video. These are my Patreon supporters as I always tell in the end of my video who are supporting me financially so that I am able to do more videos. You can also support me via Patreon or PayPal. The links of both of them are given in the description. So once again I thank you all for watching my video. Do subscribe to the channel if you have not done that yet. And also click on the bell button so that you will get notified about my future videos.